please just let this be John's baby. You know, I, I know that I've had a lot of scrubs in my life, but just give me this one, okay? Please. Please. Natalie. What are you doing in the genetics lab? I, um, I'm surprised to see you here. Is everything okay? I was just getting a witness statement. I, um, I saw you heading this way, and I figured the, uh, the amnial results must be in. Is that them? Uh, yeah. <clears throat> the, um, lab called and said that the results were in, so I just thought I'd come by and pick them up. I mean, I, I, I wasn't going to open it without you. Gee, thanks. <laughs> I guess they don't blame you for being, you know, worried that everything's all right. Yeah, thanks. I'm here now. Since we're in this thing together, have you had a chance to read them? No. Well, you say we, uh, we have a look, all right? John, just let, let, let me explain. What's an alpha protein level? Uh, oh, um, uh... Oh, here, look, you, you translate. <laughs> yeah, the, the, the AFP is, is, it's fine. There's no problem. The number here just means it's in normal limits. So that means our baby's perfect. Perfect. No health issues. I guess all that worrying was for nothing. Let's have a seat. What do you say we have a look at the rest of that? Uh, no. You can't. Why? What don't you want me to say? We shouldn't read the end of the report if we don't want to know what the sex of the baby is. You don't want to know if it's a boy or a girl? You don't want to be surprised? I thought I did, and that was before Dr. Wright and some guy in the lab found out. If they know, shouldn't we? No, no, the... You know, I, I, don't, I don't care if Dr. Wright or the lab guy or anybody else saw the sex of the baby first. I, I'm just happy that our baby's healthy. Me too. And I mean, that's all I want to be a meal for. Besides, um, I don't know. We just got some really good news. I don't want to jinx it. I understand. I mean, don't you want to save some suspense for the big day? I think it will be suspenseful enough, but... Okay. Okay? If that's what you want. That's exactly what I want. I ever tell you I'm happy about this baby. I know. Sometimes I think I make it hard for you to tell. I'm good at translating, remember? Mm -hmm. But I think you understand why part of me was holding back. I, I don't even realize I'm doing it sometimes. It's all right. It's better than all right. It's amazing. I thought you might like to know what your crazy ex-girlfriend has gotten herself into. Don't do anything, all right? Let me, let me take care of this, all right, Manning? I'm sorry, I, uh, I gotta go. Um, Todd has a, uh, a court order against Marty, and she's about to violate it. I, I need to get over and stop her before she's gonna do something she regrets. It's okay, I'll see you later. I can't remember being this happy.
promised to wait for Cole. Oh, Star! Star, open up! It's, it's Marty! I want to talk to you about Marty. Hope! Star! with Nash dying and losing Chloe, I thought I'd never be happy again. Yes. No, but now I have Brody, and we're gonna have this beautiful baby, and I finally believe in happy endings again. <laughs> you deserve a happy ending, you both do. We all do. But if you'll excuse me, I'll be right back. I just have to go and take care of something. And when I come back, all three of us will celebrate. Okay. <laughs> Did you get your results? Yeah, yeah, I did. And? Todd called you, didn't he? What are you gonna do now, arrest me? I'm just here to uphold a court order. Unbelievable. Now he's got you doing his dirty work I'm for I'm not him. doing this for Manning, I'm doing it for you. Keeping me from my granddaughter? Don't you see what he's doing? He wants you to do this. He wants you to cause trouble. He wants to keep me away from his kids. And there's no better way to accomplish that than provoking you into doing something crazy. We can all stop worrying. You mean? It's John's. My baby is John's. Todd can't do this to me. He can't keep me away from my granddaughter. No, no. Come on, let's get you out of here. That's all I have left. That's not true. I know it's a small consolation, but I promise I'd be your friend no matter what, and I meant that. I know you do. Let me be your friend. Let me take you home. Okay. Look, I know this is... It's John's baby for real? Yeah. Can you can you believe it? Oh, no, I can't. We we lucked out. Yeah, we dodged a hell of a bullet. All of that worrying and the stress and the freaking out, it was all for nothing. Everything's worked out perfectly. Yeah. Did some well, look, call me if Manning bothers you again. Oh hey! What took you so long? She give you a hard time? What, what the hell are you still doing here? I just wanted to thank you for upholding the law like a good little, little soldier. Why don't you get out of here, Manny? Okay, I will. Oh, uh, just so you guys know, Marty, if you come anywhere near my granddaughter again, I'll make sure you and Cole have adjoining cells. Thank you for stopping me and causing a scene at Dorian's. It's exactly what he wanted. I just, I, I just couldn't think straight. I understand. I am, I'm so sorry. I've been such a burden lately. Hey, stop. Look, I, I think I accepted this apology last night. Well, thank you again and again. I mean it. Has, um, <clears throat> Has Natalie gotten the results from her MDO back? I... Uh, yeah. Yeah, she did. Uh, uh, the, the baby's good. Everything's good. I'm really glad to hear that. Yeah. Fatherhood looks good on you. Who? Who saw you said I would? It was fast. Is everything okay? I heard what you said. How you dodged a bullet and, and all that worrying goes for nothing. So what you're saying is Jess, you listen. were both a lot more worried than you let on. I mean, you were really scared this baby was Ford's. Yeah, but none of that matters now. I am just so happy that all of this worked out. Let's say that again. It just maybe maybe you should lay down for a little while. Well, I thought we were gonna celebrate. We are. Maybe we can celebrate with everybody else later. Well, 
Natalie, you don't mind? No, uh, no, you go rest and we'll celebrate with Mom and Charlie when you get back. Yeah, I guess we have the rest of our lives to celebrate, right? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no, I it's a... I hope I'll be a good father. I know less about parenting than anybody on the planet. Like I said, just gotta trust that Natalie and I will figure it out as we go. Yeah, that's what you should do, just trust Natalie. Take care of yourself, okay? And this thing with Manning, just let it cool down. Things have a way of working themselves out. Okay. I certainly do.